Hey everybody, welcome to another video devotion. You know, yesterday in Bible class, we were looking at the decline of the church that started in the 1960s and talking about what might have contributed to it. And, I, and we were looking at a verse, some verses from 2 Timothy 4. And I look at the political climate there on right now and the needs around us. And these words are, are so relevant. I want to bring them up again in the, in the video. 2 Timothy 4, starting at verse 1. In the presence of God and of Christ Jesus, who will judge the living and the dead in view of his appearing in his kingdom. And I want to stop there for just a second. You know, we have so many opportunities to judge right now. And Paul reminds us right off the bat, we're not the judge. Jesus is the judge. And even if Jesus is not ready to judge yet. So in the presence of God and Christ Jesus, who will judge the living and the dead, I give you this charge. Preach the word. Be prepared in season and out of season. Correct, rebuke, encourage with great patience and careful instruction. Again, I look at our culture, and right now the church and the culture seem to be so different and so much at odds. And these words are so relevant. You know, always be ready to talk about Jesus. Always be ready to talk about the hope that you have in Jesus. But do it with great patience. Do it with careful instruction. Do it in an encouraging way is what Paul is saying. And then listen to verse 3. For the time will come when people will not put up with sound doctrine. Instead, to suit their own desires, they'll gather around them a great number of teachers to say what their itching ears want to hear. Um, said Paul says people are going to surround themselves with those who tell them what they want to hear. I think, uh, you know, if you look at what's going on politically in our world, it's like people already know what they want to hear, and they're going to align themselves with the person who tells them what they want to hear. And in the middle of this stands the church, and we've got this message that everyone needs to hear, the hope that is ours in Jesus. And so I encourage you, just as Paul said, be ready in season, out of season, but always be ready to talk about Jesus, to talk about the love that God has for you and the love God has for the world, to be, be ready to talk about the hope that is ours in Christ. And then Paul closes his letter to uh, young Timothy with these words, keep your head in all situations, endure hardship, do the work of evangelism, discharge all the duties of your ministry. Do the work of an evangelist. The evangel is the gospel. The evangelist is the one who brings the gospel. In that way, all of us, in one way or another, either with our words or with our actions, we bring the gospel. We are the evangelist. So uh, take those words with you into this week. You know, Think about the words that are coming out of your mouth. Think about what your actions are saying to other people. Be ready to share the hope that is yours in Jesus. That's it. Have a great week.